Hey race fans, thanks for tuning in to The Fix. It was a spectacular burnout this past weekend at Pocono Raceway after Kyle Busch drove his number 18 Toyota Camry from pole position all the way to victory lane. It was his 39th career victory and a 100th victory for Toyota in the Cup Series. You can order his race win diecast at lionelracing.com or your local dealer. Plus, we have some great new releases coming to you this week, starting with two offerings from Kevin Harvick. First up is his number four Bush NA Ford Fusion. Then we have his number four Bush Beer Outdoors running at Bristol Motor Speedway on August 19th. Next up, we have Ryan Blaney's number 21 Quick Lane that he drove at Indianapolis Motor Speedway earlier this season and will run once again at Talladega in the fall. Then we have two really cool Darlington releases that are going to run during the official throwback weekend of NASCAR, starting with Clint Boyer's number 14 Carolina Ford Dealers, a throwback to Mark Martin's classic paint scheme of the same name. Last but not least, we have Xfinity Series Rookie of the Year contender Cole Custer, who will be driving the Double Zero Haas Automation at Darlington Raceway, a throwback to the legendary Sam Ard. You can order all these great releases at LionelRacing.com or your local dealer. If you missed QVC Wednesday where Dale Jr. unveiled his final ride for Homestead Miami Speedway, you're getting your first look right here on The Fix. Man, and I just gotta say for all the Dale Jr. fans and Junior Nation, Dale, yeah, this car is awesome. Man, let's take a close look at this car. It's got Thank You Junior Nation on the deck lid. It's got Exalta on the hood and quarter panels. It even has the red and black paint scheme and the awesome infamous stripes that go from front to the back of the car for the infamous number eight cup car that Dale Jr. ran. This car is going to be a car that all Junior Nation fans are gonna wanna have in their collection. Probably one of the most sought after cars for 2017 for Dale Jr. And the good news is you can order this car right now from LionelRacing.com or your local dealers. This week on Collector Spotlight, we're gonna go right back in and dive in and look at some really great cars sent in on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram by some of our collectors. So let's dive right in. One of our first collectors this week is Chad Cartledge. He's got a really nice Batman car, but what's really cool is he's also got two Danica Patrick prototypes. And I gotta tell you, he's been a longtime collector and also has a really cool son named Zachariah who's a huge McDowell fan and really cool kid. And next up, we got Christopher Williamson. He's got a really cool collection of all Chase Elliott cars. He's got the Daytona win, the Tax Slayer car from 2016. He's got a Camping World Truck Series win. He's even got the Arca win. He's got Darlington win. Tons of great cars. Great collection there, Christopher. And finally, we got Amanda Lunn. And this one's really cool. She sent this one in on behalf of her eight-year-old son, Rylan. He's got a great Jeff Gordon car. It was his very first die cast and he got it on Christmas Day. Jeff Gordon's his favorite driver and he's got the Jeff Gordon Bugs Bunny color chrome. And the best part is we even met Lil Ryland and his mom in Texas Motor Speedway. Very cool. Amanda, thank you so much for sending that in behalf of Ryland. And don't forget to continue to send your favorite die cast in to us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram using hashtag the fix. If you remember last week also, we showed all those really great older cars with Michael in our, in our legal and licensing department. Well, we had a bunch of submissions on people who had had pictures of those cars, but the winner this week is Chris Wireman. Man, you had four of those great cars. Thank you so much for sending that in. Really cool story too. Chris actually got the Batman car first because he was a Batman fan. That started his die cast addiction. So Chris, congratulations, man. We will contact you soon to be shipping you that car. And finally, Diecast Santa. We've been getting a lot of questions when that can be drawn. Don't worry, we're checking that naughty and nice list right now, and on a future episode of The Fix, we're gonna start picking those winners soon.